shot in the score in a hurry. Well, Truba, there it is, gets it to go. My goodness, wow. Just like that, he get a... Oh, almost stole Whoa. on the play, too. I think he stepped out of the balance, am I correct? Yeah. Oh, that could have been a quick two, and that would have cut the lead to one. Oh, this is... This one's not over yet. I'll tell you that right now. Notre Dame press Bayport. They kind of struggled with it. Brickians, they do it very nicely here. And well, Truba just saved, I think, two points with 39 seconds to go. Booking her head to the line. Now we got bonus. Two here, Pirates can make it really difficult on Pulaski. 39 seconds left, and he'd really need one stop. Bookie's got 24, I think, on the night. This will be 25 and 26. Missed Bookie it. Misses it. And now Pulaski, quick pass to Schultz. Hendricks is, oh. That's going to be the sixth foul. So. Oh. Did he get him a reach or what was, what they call? Two timeouts apiece. I'm surprised that coach... Yeah, Polkowski hasn't a call timeout right here. I don't know why Pulaski was such a quick run. Risky pass to Schultz there. Schultz to three. Oh, Schmidt there. Dorn goes up, draws contact, and two shots coming. And now Once again, we can't rebound on the offense, Dorn defensive can, end. Dorn can make these two free throws. Pulaski can try and get the ball and fall. They're still, this is a one-possession game right now. But Dorn needs to make these free throws. Dorn missed it. And you needed to make that. No, no, you got to make this one here. Cut it to two. It's single bonus on both sides right now. Missed them both. Gets his own rebound. Goes up. Trying to get the two to Hargley. Schmidt recovers it. Now Pulaski can look for a three. With Truba. No. Cornette finally grabs the rebound. Oh, Pulaski had their chances there. The two free throws. The rebound. The other rebound. The three. Get an offensive rebound on a free throw. Pulaski can't take advantage of it. Now Cornette will go to the line. The eighth team foul, so we're still in single bonus. Both teams have had their chances here down the stretch. Oh, I don't think you're Pulaski. I don't think you're getting a better look than that on offense. As Coach Polkowski says, I'll take a timeout. I got two left. Give me one now. They had two free throws. Dorn got his own rebound. He tried to get his two points the hard way. But couldn't get it to go. Well, Truba had a, I think he rushed the three a little bit there. DePierre leads 52-39 with just under five minutes. This game's been back and forth all night long. Girls are up four with 12 minutes left. Ooh, they're looking for their first one on the year. As Cornette's going to shoot the ball in his free throws, if he misses the first, Pulaski has one more timeout left. They can get it across and set up a play. Pulaski, I don't think they had a really good chance. Two free throws, got the missed free throw from Blake. Schultz missed the three. Dorn got the rebound. Head to the line, missed both free throws. Bayport now up 46-29. The girls are up after being down 17-2. 46, they're, they're probably going to win. They're, it looks like they are. Get their first win on the year here. Or there, I should say, as Cornette misses it. And now Pulaski has a chance to tie the game. 15 seconds to go. Well, let's see what timeout coming. That's going to be tipped. That's going to... Yep, that stays for Pulaski. Yep. 11 seconds to go. Polkowski does not want to call timeout. He feels like he likes the out-of-bounds, but they're going to run a little elevator play here. Watch this. I will get in and call timeout here. Let's see it into the big man. Holowinski with Truba. Schmidt. Holowinski... For three. No. Rebounded. Schmidt tries to get it. Got to go quick. But Truba got the look. Short. Bayport 